off-road. I'm the driver of the Ultra 4 Pro Car 4485, and we're here at SEMA 2013. All right, so this has a 695 horsepower custom LS engine that will run in the Torco SR5 2050 in. Um, we've also got Rock Jock 70s, these are custom housings. Um, we're running the Torco 250 weight in there. So um, this is all very heavy duty, high performance for this really intense Ultra Four style racing. It's, it's the toughest single day race that there is. So on this car, we've got quad bypass king shocks. These are special shocks that really slow down the wheel suspension and uh, they're, they're actually has built-in bump stops. So for off-road racing, this is super important to control how much you're hammering through the ruts and whoop de doos Falcon is our tire sponsor and they're introducing a brand new tire here at SEMA. It's a brand new mud terrain. They prepare a special sticky tire for us that we can run at a higher pressure, but it's got a super sticky compound. That's key for the type of racing we're doing where you have to go fast and slow. So this car is a custom chassis. And as part of the, the custom chassis, what we do is the engine is offset to the passenger side and it's also angled so that it's actually pointing toward the driver's seat. So to do this, what we've done is offset it from the differential because we've got a big suspension coming up and down, and it also offsets the weight. So the car has a perfect 50-50 balance front to rear and left to right. All right, the next thing is we're on the cockpit. So this is a two-passenger car. It's very tight. This is, this is not built for comfort. When you get in here, you feel like a fighter pilot. You're strapped in, it's tight, it's all business. In here, we've got a complete digital dash so that the driver and co-driver can see exactly what's happening and it's got special alarms built in it. Even little things, like you'll notice I've got a watch here on the rear view mirror. That's so when I enter certain sections of the course, I can make note of the time and see how my split times are doing to make sure we're going as fast as we can through the course. Next, the car has everything on this car has a redundant system. Two batteries, two radiators, two trans coolers, two fans on every cooler. We've, there's, there's double everything, so if something fails, we can just switch over to the second fuel pump or the second radiator or fan. So very important. We run a, a large Griffin radiator here in the back of the car. This helps distribute the weight and it also keeps the radiator out of harm's way. Because when you're desert racing to pass somebody, sometimes you've got to go through nasty bushes or you're right on them where you're getting roosted and you don't want to damage the radiator. A good size exhaust. We've got to be able to get all the, that exhaust out from a 700 horsepower engine all the way to the back of the car. That's part of the regulations. So on the rear differential, you can see that it's heavily trussed. This is a special Curry Rock Jock 70. So it's got a 10 and 5 8 inch ring gear. These are really heavy duty, big tubes, all chromoly. We're running a 40 spline axle inside of here. This is really heavy duty built, but it's very susceptible. We can break these with this kind of horsepower really easy. So also key to having Torco fluids in here to keep that ring and pinion alive. We were only getting like 300 miles out of them. Now we're getting over a thousand. After switching to Torco? Yeah. Okay, so we've got a couple of things on this side of the car. This is a spare drive shaft with the proper U-bolts, wrenches, everything you need. This drive shaft fits front or rear on this car. So again, having spare parts, redundancy. Um, you'll also notice we've got a quick fuel fuel right here. This is so the guys can dump in 11 gallons in three seconds is about what it takes. All right, so this class car, this is an unlimited four wheel drive class. The only rule in this class is that it has to have a high low transfer case. Otherwise, it's completely unlimited. Engine size, 
tire size, wheelbase, weight of the car, everything is unlimited. If you think it can win, you bring it on race day. So if you're interested in this class, you can go to ultra4racing.com for the main race site. Um, we've got videos on YouTube, so you can go to the Genrite YouTube channel or you can go to the genrite.com website and we've got video links there too and you can see some of the videos and then there's links over to YouTube. So lots of good stuff, very exciting form of racing. Um, it's, it's limited, there's about 500 cars that race in this class, but only 100 can qualify on race day. So it's a very competitive class and a lot of guys are really battling. Um, it's, it's one of those kind of races where literally if somebody breaks down in front of you, you can run them over as per the rules. So it's a, it's a very intense race day.